Hello. Welcome back to Vintage Story. I'm gonna do this little chore here before I forget about it. Um. So we're going prospecting today. probably check on the farm first. I really want to get out there and have as much time doing that as I can possibly have. I kind of need to make food though. So let's kind of do that. Um, am I keeping firewood anywhere at this point? I guess down here maybe? Not en not enough. Not enough. Uh, am I keeping any non-pine? Yes. Okay. Um... Put this here for now. And that's fine. So, one thing about this setup, I guess, is that I'm not going to have, not going to be able to get close enough to the cooking thing in order to just put stuff in directly from the storage pots. But that's fine. I'm not going to be too concerned about that. <coughs> ah. Um... Oh, one thing, I just got the new update for 1.16.4, and it said that these can dry on a tool rack now. It also said I could dry on a box, maybe? Maybe in a box? I don't know. I'm going to put it on the tool rack. Hopefully it'll keep drying. Um, that should be fine. Is there anything else I want to do around here before I go anywhere? Where is, um... I still got a little over a day left. I'm gonna move this one over here. And that's out of order, but that's okay. I don't think any of this... Well, this certainly is not in a spot I intend it to be long term. This certainly is not where I intend it to be long term. is two servings. I'll bring that one with me. I have boards, I have sticks. I'm gonna bring this sign with me since it's not really in use right now. <coughs> I'm okay. I always forget something. I'm so used to forgetting something. How's the chicken doing? My one chicken. Got free eggs. You got 
enough food. Here's another egg. Thanks. Thank you. Can I have this? Can I have this? Thank you. You got enough food. I'll be fine. Ow. Is that really far enough for fall damage? Alright. I have wasted enough time. I don't even want to do anything with that. I want to dig in the ground. I probably... Well, I, it's fine. I probably should have brought another pick. That's fine. I still need to check on those other pine trees. The sap trees. Uh, this will be fine. Going through the water like this. Are you, are you going to go? I guess maybe it doesn't do the fast swimming thing if I'm close to a ledge in the water and I'm crouching. I still don't really know how that does or doesn't work all the time. I still think it's probably smart of me to pick up these loose rocks because I still care about them. Still need a lot of them. See if I can find this hole I was starting to dig over here. Not really sure if I can. Well, here's a hole. This is an actual hole, and it's actually unstable. But it will give me some samples. This is exposed rock with samples. I'm going to get this to collapse, too. that just light this up down here a little bit yeah because it opened up the roof a little bit still goes deeper still spooky this one also appears to go deeper or it doesn't okay it does not and we can open this up and not let that become something annoying later yeah. There's a whole bunch of basically surface quartz. I'm not going to get any of it. I'm actually here to be sampling. Where do I want this sign to go? This is still a little bit unstable. Um, this is still a little unstable. I'm not going to worry about that, though. I will put this sign right here. Where's my prospecting pick? Not sure if that's far enough away. Oh, it is. Nice. <coughs> ah. That's not far enough away. There we go. Well, there's some magnetite. I didn't bring coal. God. Every time. 
every time I forget something. I don't care about that. So bad at this. I guess if I were good at it, it'd be too easy. That makes sense, right? Um, I need some coal. Don't actually need very much. That's all I wanted. Should probably get these bees taken care of. So much to do. It really doesn't help. When I forget to do something, it ends up being just a major time sink. Oh, that wasn't very much. <coughs> See, now I'm not swimming at all. I'm not near a ledge. I am crouching in one layer deep water. I don't get it. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I should probably get those torches off of my hotbar. And I need some actual food. That's not so deep. Looks like it's just a little underground pondish thing. It's not where I was. This one. That one goes a little deeper. Still doesn't look too deep. Still don't want to go in it. <coughs> Alright, where was... There it is. Have decent cinnabar. Very poor stalactite. Very poor smooth knight. And very poor magnetite. So that's actually. I'm actually a little bit happy about that. That means there's magnetite somewhere. I don't 
don't see any exposed rock on that. Or on this. How far away is that? That's... I think that's... I think that's where it is? Let's go a little bit further. That's that merchant. Let's do this like here ish. Um, no, oh, that's nice. All right, I uh, need a sign. So, poor Cinnabar. Very poor Copper. What? That's not right. That's not right. I'm gonna assume that this will get fixed. Or maybe there's something that I did wrong with that. That's not right. Um, very poor. I'm gonna say magnetite because I that's the one I kind of care about. Very poor bismuthite. Okay, so and the, the percentage was higher over here. So let's get a place that's a little bit in between. Okay. I'm okay. Let's just line this up this time. Because I assume it's the slanted signs that are having some difficulty. Yes, this is a little bit higher right here. This is just poor copper. Very poor magnetite. Poor Midnight and very poor spare. Let's try this direction. But I think, depending on how big this is, I don't think that's necessarily out of line enough to 
rule out that direction as being the the sort of the center of it. I don't want that flower. I want to avoid that flower. I'm already out of food. And it's not even very late. Oh, come on. Floating sign is fine. Copper. I'm not even going to record Cinnabar. Oops, poor Bismuth Knight. Very poor Magnetite. Right. Hmm. Interesting. Let's try in this direction. Oof. 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 Don't want to go in there. It's probably not far enough. Okay. And what was the one that was not zero? Sphalerite. All right, let's check over here. That was the first sample, and it's been basically the same in a little bit of a loop right here. So if this is a little bit higher, this is going to be probably a really awful um, Magnetite area. Just a really awful load. That's far enough. Okay.
Oops, I made two, that's okay. Maybe it's still further that direction? I don't know. It seems weird. It seems like it's just bad. This is decent copper. This is poor bismuth night. Very poor magnetite. And very poor spoiler right. Can I push the right buttons? Thank you. All right. Let's try a little further this direction. This is exposed rock that's not too hard to get into. Doesn't look too hard to get into. Yeah. Ultra high copper. How about that? Decent bismuth night. Poor cassiterite at 0.1%. I'm not even going to record that. Um, that percent is not that much different. And it is getting a little bit late. So this is an ultra high copper spot. Maybe I'll be coming back here. I don't care about that. Also, <coughs> over there, getting a little bit closer to Bismuth Night. So, we already have a whole bunch of zinc. So, maybe we could be getting close to Bismuth Bronze as well if we find a vein of that.
Um, I guess it's not super late yet, so I'm gonna go see if I can get the resin that's over here. That's probably over here. Really? That's like perfectly in the way? That is like right where you need to not be. And I'm hungry. Okay. I guess I'm going home. I got one of them. dirt in here. And that one's empty. Um. Still didn't really find iron, unfortunately. Oh, actually, before I do this, put this back down. should have another vessel to put this stuff in. Um, where's the... this is the other green one, so I'm going to put these two next to each other over here. the issue with that is why is this one slightly worse I mean, it's real and why is this one slightly better hmm. so confusing not significant just wish I knew Should have enough space to pick up most of this stuff.
that one's not done yet. And I'm full. I didn't quite get all of it. I'll come back and finish it up though. Uh, I guess I don't need this. space there. Oh, put that in here now. Maybe. Just in case. That's what happened with that one. We have one of these that has flax green. We have some vegetables somewhere. Here we go. They sound close, but. Oh, there is one in here. <laughs> Keeping it too dark. Keeping it a little too dark in here. Ow. Guess down here. That seems to be where they're coming from. Probably over here. They're coming from everywhere. Why do I do this to myself? This looks a little dark too. I mean, I 
thought they were only really supposed to spawn close to a rift. Maybe that means there's a rift or oh my god. There must be a rift around. It's one of the other changes that I was reading about is that you won't necessarily hear rifts if you don't have, or at least you won't hear them as well if you don't have line of sight to them. So if I'm inside and there's a rift real close, I may not I may not necessarily know it's there. <laughs> if it's close enough to spawn guys inside of my house. Necessarily, no. Do you hear one? But I don't know where it is. <coughs> um, and I wanted to put, I wanted to put seeds away. I guess I'm sort of keeping this fire clay over here at the moment. actually end up getting a lot today. Let's see. Let's cook up some more stuff. guys.
Um. this up not really okay uh, this starting to get light hopefully they'll stop spawning in my house you have to figure out how that's happening must just be there must just be a rift that's too close and there's spots in my house that are too dark I think I was hearing it up here Maybe it's gone now. It might be gone now. Seems like it's gone now. That was moderately annoying. Oops. And I will hold on to this one. Alright. So it's getting a little bit light out. I think today or tomorrow. I'm going to go back out there and do some digging. So I want to bring the extra pick. I still like to find actual magnetite, but for that one spot having potentially good amount of copper and potentially some bismuthite, bismuthonite, whatever it is, um, seems like it's a pretty good spot to dig down and see what I can find. So. I think that's going to be the plan. I'm going to call it here. And I will see you next time.